Like, wait. That wasn't right. What's in here? Remember, back home. Oh, cow. Oh, back home too. I remember this video game. Oh, it's a video game? It was made just after I was created, I think. I can't remember it well. The scientists and I spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun. I miss him. I can't remember his name. Stanley. Brian. <laughs> Maybe I'm the scientist. The cat scientist. Yeah, the cat scientist. Professor Charles, actually! Not gonna do anything about this? Alright. You did it just to piss him off. You like looked over your shoulder. You like fucking do something about it, bitch. <laughs> once you hit, once you hit a cat, I'll report you. I'm gonna report you to the ASPCA. Yeah. Thought you like kicked me out or something. But you didn't. You, I guess he's too depressed to do anything. Or maybe he knows he already lives in a fucking shithole, and it doesn't matter. That too, maybe. There, that area. Go there. Haven't you? Already, well, I mean, you're allowed to explore. But you were saying, like, you're like I, I keep getting distracted. I'm not telling you not to explore. I'm just telling you not to forget your objective. Oh. Because you explore for, like, two seconds, and then you go, What am I supposed to do? <laughs> it's like, explore, and then when you come out... I think you already got what you wanted in here, because you already grabbed the notebook earlier. Yeah, yeah. You were, like, ahead of yourself. Oh, shit. But there's two there's two other outsider notebooks you got to find in this in the area. In this area? Yeah. You already... Not in this room. You already grabbed... Not in this apartment. Oh, not in this apartment. Oh. Yeah, there's two other apartments in this, like, city area. City district. That have outsider notebooks. Because you got Momos, and you just got... Earlier. I forget which person you... Oh! What the fuck? What the cat doing? What the cat doing? So then I got out to find another symbol area? Uh, yeah. Maybe that? Right there? All right. What do I have to do? The four notebooks, Terry. <laughs> you have two of them. You have Momo's and whatever. The, I think it was, her name was Clementine or something. Clementine? Yeah, I think that was the other notebook. Okay. I gotta. F yeah, I gotta go to like. So there's two the more Clementine. symbols that you're looking for. Okay. <clears throat> two symbols. Hey, do you remember what the symbol looks like? No. Nice. The way I can look. Right there, you see that blue symbol? Yeah. Big frowny face? Big frowny face. Yep, you're looking for that. That's the outsider symbol. Oh, okay. So you're looking for where the outsider's apartments are so that you can find their notebooks. There's four outsiders. Yeah, I'm two seeing of them. Like, sm like smiley faces, no frowny faces. Oh, there's one. Didn't take look, at you, look at you! I'm trying to actually look. I'm trying to, you know, you know, get through this game, and I get side. <laughs> At some point today. Yeah. No, take a fuck ton. Well, this is Doc. Doc. Okay. Yeah. You're looking for Doc's notebook here. <laughs> this music when you're searching apartments is so good. Yeah. Music feels like an adventure. <laughs> hey, Doc, I found the keys to your safe. You need to be more careful with these. It's not enough to bury your safe behind a bunch of books. Just a librarian. Their actual language probably sounded more like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dial up. <laughs> <laughs> How to develop your artificial intelligence in order to be as creative as a real human. Volume 42. Oh my goodness. Absolutely a masterpiece. Yeah. I just realized the volume is really fucking loud and it's probably picking that up. <laughs> I always forget to turn it back down. Let's see what's inside of here. I'm a place to take Oh, a nap. he's going to sleep. Fuck. <laughs> Get the fuck up, lazy ass. <laughs> Ain't got time for this shit. God, there's like so many sleeping areas. God damn. Did you pick up the music sheet? Yeah, I picked up the music sheet. I picked up the music sheet. I picked up the music sheet. I'm gonna remix your stutters. God. <laughs> 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 I think that's everything. 
You sure? Well, I got a key. I gotta unlock something. Yeah. He's probably trying to find that safe that just the librarian mentioned. Oh, yeah. I'm looking. <clears throat> no, it's not there. Not here either. Hmm. Oh. Is it up here? Oh! No. Fuck. Oh. <laughs> I just did that accidentally. She literally said behind a bunch of books. She did. <laughs> she did. What is that? Jack's notebook. No, that... Choco meow, meow Meow statue thingy. I forget what they're called. But it, like, wishes great luck on you or something. Nice work, another notebook. Sounds like some furry shit. Well, it's a Korean thing. Or Chinese. It's Japanese? just a whole country of furries, basically. Yes. <laughs> I fucking love, like, like I'm a... Japan. Yeah, Japan, Jap Japanese version of furries. Because they're called kimono. They call furries like kimono, like kimono furries or some shit. I fucking love it. It's like a sore over there. <laughs> no, they're like these like cutesy, like you know, chubby, like you know, like like I'm a thin set, thick thighed furries. Yeah. I don't think you have to add more adjectives. I think that's just called furry. <laughs> I don't the... Adding adjectives doesn't make it better. <laughs> it's the you know Japanese you know furry. Yeah. With extra steps. <laughs> it's just a furry with extra steps. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I... Went through all that. Mm -hmm. Got that notebook. I gotta find another one. Yep. Okay. One more. <clears throat> I'm guessing it might be lower down, maybe. Maybe. I mean, there's also other things to do in this area. Yeah. I found a few things. Lots of random little things to do. I'm not lost. I'm fine. Hmm. I detect a Terry playing this game. Do you Is that need a help? Friend? No, that's a person. Oh, shit. Is that a... Oh, <laughs> you saw their face and you're yeah. just like, Is that a sign? <laughs> Is that like a, a frowny face? Whole ass person. Elliot programming. Knock on the door and wait for us to open. What's up? Can I talk to you? Let me just squeeze through here. Oh, sheet music. Nestor, you here for Elliot? He's just over there. Any other things over here? Oh, another piano for you to create beautiful music with. <laughs> yes. My inner Beethoven. The tree is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that human ingenuity found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. It's what the humans would have wanted. Boom, 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 boom. Funky baseline. Yeah. Why are you shaking like that? Yes, can I help you? Duh. Oh yes, everyone around here knows this symbol. It's the outsiders. They live on the upper floors of this area. You can probably talk to Momo about this. Is that the talk to once I finish? Once I am, uh, get them all? Probably be a good idea. But he did tell you they live on the upper floors, so you know the last apartment is not on ground floor. Yeah. Oh, here we go. No? Okay. Ah, yes! Nothing! <laughs> <laughs> here we go. Up. Oh. There we go. And. Yep, right here. Bam. Boom. Bada boom pow. Saw that area. Oh, there it is. <laughs> More like squeaks than like meows. I mean, cats do that shit all the time. Yeah. Sometimes they meow and they're just like meow. And other times they're just like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they just open their mouth for like several seconds and just go. This is like a half-hearted like you know like meow. Oh look, it's the place you were in earlier. Did I already grab everything? No, already? you never found it. You just searched it like one of the first things you did is search this building and you never found the notebook. Oh. Well, shit. Well, let me look this time. Where this is be? like detective music. I love it. Yeah. Oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> you just walk past it. <laughs> Finally, the last notebook. This one seems to belong to someone named... 
Zabalt Tazar. <laughs> I'm imagining the robot staring directly into the cat's eyes. Someone named. <laughs> What is this? How, it's so many words. There was one word! <laughs> it's just like amalgamation of letters, I mean. Zabaltazar. All trace of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Zerks. They seem to eat almost anything that moves and breed at an in inconceivable rate. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I wish I was a Zerk. Uh, no, I don't want to be a parasite. I fucking hate <laughs> parasites. It's worth. No. I just want to breed in an inconceivable rate. <laughs> <laughs> Some good. As if being locked in this city wasn't hard enough. <laughs> oh. There's also a note in this book. It says I found a design flaw in the transceiver, but I think I figured out how to fix it. Here's the equation. With this, we should be able to help Momo repair the transceiver. If it can communicate with the upper levels, that could be our way up. Let's show him what we found. 